first of all, liability letter is a document that is given by the bank to a person who has a mortgage, right? Or who has a certain liability towards the bank. So, and this document states what's the exact amount of the liability or of mortgage is remaining to be paid off to the bank. Now, let's say you are selling your property. So a liability letter will be a solid proof in case if your buyer wants to pay the mortgage on your behalf, what's the exact amount? Now, some people might assume, all right, so I took a mortgage like five years ago, last five years I, I paid around 6,000, so the outstanding should be, let's say 500,000. But in reality, the, the exact amount of mortgage that is left to be paid will be calculated up to the fills, or we say cents. So it will never be a round figure, something like 500,000. It will be something like, for example, 521,000 dirhams, 37 fills, right? So one fill is just equal to one cent. I mean, it's um, just a smaller denomination of a currency, right? So we have a dirham, then we have fills. So liability letter usually uh, is valid for 14 days. So as soon as you get it, and you need to act quick in order to pay off your mortgage because when you get a liability letter, it's actually calculated for 14 days advance. So when you pay a mortgage, you pay actually including the next 14 days, right? So that's why in order for you to get a liability letter, there are different ways. First one, you simply visit the bank and you request it. Second, some banks, you can do it online or third, you can do it literally over the phone by calling uh, by dialing a number, right? So it depends on the bank. So based on what bank you have, so you will have to approach the bank accordingly and request your liability letter. So hope this was helpful for you. Thank you, thumbs up, subscribe, and have a great day.